Labor and the expression of worth is coming to the Eastern High Plains. Well, thank you, God, for cruise control. I was a 28-year-old husband and the father of three children, four and under, when I arrived at the New Mexico Christian Children's Home. I was deeply disillusioned, feeling betrayed by family, church, and state. I am always immensely grateful for the opportunity that we were given by uh, Charles Anderson, Rod Self, Darwin Culpepper, Butch and Judy, all the grace that we were shown as a young family. I remember that first Christmas uh, with my three young kids and just being so grateful that we had this little tree and a place, a safe place to be. Just down the road from us, thank God, I met this man and his family. This is Ken Luna, and he had a wall full of instruments, and we started playing music together, and I was so incredibly grateful to meet the Lunas. In fact, this music that you're listening to right now, this composition, is uh, Ken Luna's piece. It's called Mike's Waltz, and I loved it so much that I... I just, I recorded it. I asked him if I could use it. He said yes. I don't know what I'm doing now. There's, uh, this video could go on forever and ever. I connected with Chris Beatty and Dustin Seifert up at uh, Eastern New Mexico University. I started teaching there. Just so many opportunities opened up. Uh, South Plains College in Leveland. Got to teach there for a while. So many wonderful things. Uh, students that I met. Uh, segue into students. Yes, Adam Penland and Zach Ballinger. I'm going to connect with you guys soon. Uh, uh, family, another brilliant young mind. Ethan Gonzalez, brilliant young man, and my my oldest daughter, Anna Gonzalez. También. <laughs> Anthony Salas, going to connect with you, hopefully, my friend. Oh, there's such an outpouring of love, such deep love and uh, there's so many people that I know and love, Ed Flo and Ron Ship and Yoli and oh my gosh, it, it's isn't it silly to start naming names, if, especially if you if you're trying to have some kind of uh, public presence like I am, uh, you start naming names and you're always going to leave people out. That's that's a sad thing, but I guess we do have communities and there are. There are people that we mention and that we love and ways that we give thanks. And that is the purpose of this today. I'm heading your way. I hope that we get to connect. We've got some work to do together. Labor and the expression of worth. Let's discover our common work together. Strengthening a tribe member deepens a tribe. Depth tribes feed the world. Labor and the expression of of worth. Some of us who were bound as children are now bound to be free. <laughs> Come on, everybody. Let's go. Labor and the Expression of Worth. Travel and Trav is a singer, songwriter, poet, essayist, metaphysical therapist, teacher, healer, father, and an advocate for the homeless and neurodivergent. He is an encourager, a deeply flawed human being, and a somewhat reluctant, yet grateful, follower of the one that we have called Jesus. Trav's working practice is now an integration of his diverse career experiences, which includes time in the military, police, academia, and physical therapy. His personal journey to overcome genetically inherited trauma makes him an expert on mental health issues and trauma recovery. Humanity is making the leap into the non-dual. We are moving beyond the binary into a more fluid state. This is evident in our most recent explorations of gender identification. In the depths of Christ, there is no male or female. Travel and Trav is developing educational materials which encourage the alignment of our rational and mystical senses. These educational tools will help us to manage this species-wide transition in our consciousness. 
Together, we are developing a new language to describe this caramelized, dystopian world in which we live. Because we are stumbling toward our next evolutionary threshold, we must learn to both sing the blues and transcend the oppression that inspired the blues in the first place. We rise above our tendency to manifest as either the oppressed or the oppressors. Labor and the Expression of Worth is Trav's compassionate philosophical container which creates the necessary inner space to hold multiple perspectives simultaneously. Labor and the Expression of Worth is a context in which we may align our work with one another around our deepest common values. We must educate, strengthen, and encourage one another. Strengthening a tribe member deepens a tribe. Deep tribes can feed the world. It is essential that the consciousness level of our species is deepened. We need a new perspective from which to solve the diverse and many problems that humanity has created for itself. In order to raise our consciousness, we must encourage deep communication between the generations. Trav is reaching out to the generations who came before him and after him. Thank you for supporting Travel and Trav by contributing monthly through Patreon. Every little bit helps. May we discover our deepest common values together and align our efforts appropriately. The future of our species depends on it. Strengthening a tribe member deepens a tribe. Depth tribes feed the world. Sincerely, Travis Irwin. <laughs>